Hey, this is Jake Kelly for the Live to Play Network. It's another fine day. We're taking a look at the Gretsch Electromatic G5440 bass. It's a hollow body bass with a long scale neck. It's 34 inches from the bridge to the nut. We're going to uh, go ahead and sample some of the sounds and then we'll come back and talk about the construction of this bass. All right, let's listen first to the treble pickup. Now up here. Same thing with the bridge pick or the neck pickup. Long scale neck, perhaps we should listen to uh, some of the lower register of the instrument. Um, here we go. And now let's listen to the neck pickup. As we mentioned before, this is a hollow body instrument. It's about two and a quarter inch deep, or two and a half inch deep actually. Uh, the uh, body is made out of maple, maple ply for the top, back, and sides. I said it's hollow, and it is, but uh, underneath the bridge, uh, inside the body is a sound post that connects the top and the back, and that helps reduce feedback has a trapeze bridge and a tunematic type tailpiece or a tunematic type bridge so uh, you can fully intonate the instrument. The uh, controls on the on this bass are a volume control for each of the two pickups and then a master tone control and then up here on the upper bout we have a master volume control three-way pickup selector. The neck is maple. It has rosewood fingerboard. As I uh, mentioned before, the scale length is 34 inches, so it's a fender scale bass, or fender scale as preferred by many bass players. And two on the side headstock with uh, closed back tuning gears. It's this beautiful orange color, which is uh, reminiscent of the uh, Chet Atkins hollow bodies uh, that Gretsch made and makes now. Uh, so kind of a rockabilly vibe a little bit. I should mention that these pickups are humbucking pickups. They're Gretsch Filtertron blacktop pickups. They're similar to the uh, Filtertron pickups that Gretsch was making during the 70s. And it's a uh, these are made especially for the bass. There's uh, two pole pieces for each string uh, per pickup on these. And what's also nice is that the surrounds of the pickup, uh, where the pickup is sus suspended from, has adjustments so you can adjust the angle of the pickup as well as the height. So you can match 
the uh, the pickup and have it run perfectly parallel to the string. All right, let's uh, listen to the bass uh, being used with the pick. And here's the same thing in the treble position. Well, there you go. It's a little sample of the Gretsch 5440 Electromatic Bass. This is Jake Kelly for the Live to Play Network. We'll see you next time.